all right welcome back guys so basically um we've been able to see something about the folder structure not too in-depth but at least we've been able to see the basics okay and in the last one we identified that this home is actually a page right all right so i'm going to go back to our ionic toolkit okay and it's a little bit compressed here so maybe i'll just maximize it just for so we can understand what we are doing so after we create an ionic app right and we've opened the app in the browser which is what we have here okay um i want us to go to the next step and basically the next step is i want us to be able to create a page in ionic so there is the command we use to create a page and that's what we have here ionic generate page and then the name of the page is the last parameter here so but if we minimize this and look at our application folder here you see that we already have a home page so it doesn't make sense to create another home page so first off let me just go ahead and close this welcome screen we don't actually need it okay so let's see the next option here now we are going to create another page entirely okay so this is the command ionic generate page but we want this new set of pages to be inside a folder and that folder is going to be named pages okay that's basically what this means here so let me just open this up if you see here it says create other pages inside a separate folder named pages right so before we start you know playing with ionic page components i just want us to at least know how to create a page okay so i'm going to copy this and i'll go ahead and minimize this one more time and then i'll come to the command line now you notice something in the command line we don't have the path if you let me just show you what the path actually means so this c drive ionic my first app and all of that that's the path we don't have that in this because we are actually running a um we're actually running a kind of server that's why we don't have the path so what we're going to do to you know create a new terminal is we're going to click on this plus icon okay so if you see here there is new terminal or you can use the sh um, shortcut Control shift and back tick so but then i'll just go ahead and click on this new terminal and it will open a new command prompt for me and as you can see in this new one we have the path okay so remember i copied the command to create a new page inside the pages folder so i'll just right click and the command will be pasted in okay so this is ionic generate page and the name of the page is contact but it's going to be inside a folder named pages so all the if i'm going to create 10 pages in this application all the 10 pages will be inside these pages folder it's only the home page that will not be inside the pages folder and that's how we are going to structure any application we create i hope it's clear so basically all we need to do at this point is press enter and let's watch what happens so it's going to actually take a few uh, moments to create a page and i think i'm going to pause the video just to save time okay so that we don't have oh, all right all right okay there's no need for me to pause the video because the page is already created now let's come and look at our folder structure so remember we the there is a home page which came with the application but see this command we create we ran just now has created a new folder here and that folder is named pages if i open this folder by clicking on this arrow you see that we have contacts so there is the contact page inside it okay and we have this um files so for every page you create there there's going to be six files one two three four five six we're not actually working with the six of them okay when we start playing around with ionic components we are going to see the files that are relevant so but what i'm going to do is i'll create another page so i'll just press the upward arrow to oh i'll click on this terminal and press the upward arrow to access my last command so i'm going to delete this and i'll say i want to create a page called about 
okay and i'll hit enter so let's give it a few minutes or sorry a few moments come on all right so it says okay generated page now if i come here to my um, folders area and i click on pages you see that we now have about and contacts okay so essentially i hope you get what we're trying to do here there is the home page that is going to be a standalone page and then every other page we create if we're going to create 10 pages they would all be inside the pages folder okay so if we wanted to create home page first for example if we did not have a home page we're going to use this command to just create a home page and then for every other page we create we're going to use this command because we want them to be inside the pages folder all right so that's basically what i want you to know about how to create pages in ionic in the next lecture we're going to start working with ionic components for styling our page